any tattoo that I do for somebody. It's almost like adding new life into, into my artwork as well as, as my own life. The little guy I met kind of brought it into the limelight that I was the first Haida tattoo artist in over 100 years. It's in our DNA to be artists. I've been interested in uh, traditional tattoos for a few years now. Since then, it's been uh, a yearning to also feel like I can wear them as well. And it's been a journey, a journey to get there, to be able to wear them proudly and confidently um, and without any shame. Tattooing is the first thing I've done where it feels timeless. And there's like this vivid connection that happens. There's something else with a hand poke tattoo that's impressive, I guess, in its experience. And I think people just want to take back their identity. The work of the revival of tattooing has uh, helped me to feel whole and stronger and firmer in my own identity as an Indigenous person and as an Ifakma person. If we can anchor a youth in their identity where they're proud of who they are, then they can feel that in their life and they can feel good about being Indigenous. This practice has been asleep for over 100 years and we want to ensure that the revival of it is really built on that solid foundation.